In this video, we will show you how to replace your transmission cooler line connector on this Chevy Tahoe. This will be located under your vehicle along the passenger side of your transmission. Let's get into it. All right, friends, let's get started on our job. The first thing that I need to mention is you want to make sure that the engine and the exhaust is cool to the touch because we will be working in this area and this is your exhaust. With that said, we're going to remove this shield. In the center of it, you're going to find that you have a 10 millimeter bolt here and then follow it back, you'll find a second one. Remove the pair. We'll get the one that's a little harder to get to. There's that one. We'll do the same to the other one. Now that we have that out of the way, you have a nice clear view of your transmission lines. You have one right out in the open down here. The other one's located just above it. To remove the line from the connector, we're going to use a small pry bar. Come right in between this area and gently pull this black locking ring away. Now with that locking ring out of the way, we have a clear view of the connector. On that connector, you'll find that you have a small snap ring that makes its way three quarters of the way around. You're going to have to use a small pick to pull this out of place. This is what the lock should look like right here. Now that I've got my pick underneath this, I'll just go ahead and grab onto that little locking clip and pull it out of there. There's the clip. Now the next thing we'll do is make sure we have a collection bucket under the area so we can recycle any fluid properly. Continue on with the pry bar and pry that line out of place. Now if you're planning on doing the top connector as well, now's the time to do that one while the bottom line is still out of place. To remove the connector, we'll use an 18 millimeter socket and unscrew it from the transmission. There it is, friends. Let's move along to cleaning and inspecting our mounting hole. You want to make sure that it's not damaged or cracked in any way. Now we can get ready for the installation of our brand new transmission line connector. You'll find that you already have the thread sealant in place. Go ahead and take this and screw it all the way down to the transmission. Okay, right there it bottomed out. Let's give it a little extra to make sure it's nice and tight. Now it's time to align our transmission line with the transmission line connector and press it into place. If you can't press it by hand, you can also try to use a small prying device. Just be very careful not to damage the line in any way. We'll listen for a click coming from that connector. Now I'll try prying it away from the transmission to make sure it's completely secured. You do not want this falling off while you're driving down the road. Once you're sure it's locked in place, continue on with your black plastic locking piece. Slide that on there. That ensures that that clip cannot fall off on its own. Double check it all the way around. Let's clean our mess. Now we can continue on to our metal shield. Go ahead and take that and put it in place. Start in each of your 10 millimeter mounting bolts and snug them up. Okay, let's get out from underneath the vehicle and make our way back under the hood. It's important to make sure that you check your transmission fluid when you're done the service. 
To do that, you're going to want to start up the vehicle, let it run, and get up to normal operating temperature well on a flat and level surface. Once you're at that point, with the vehicle still running in park, come over to your transmission dipstick. We'll go ahead and lift this up and out of here. We'll lift that up and out of here and give it a quick look. On the transmission dipstick, you're going to find that you have two little dots. You want to make sure the fluid level is in between those dots. Anywhere below the lower dot, you need to add a little bit. Anywhere above, go ahead and drain a little bit out. After that, go ahead and take that dipstick and put it back in place. Shut the hood, take your vehicle for a road test. Thanks for watching. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.